I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. Cedric the Entertainer feels that in order to compete with Donald Trump on the campaign trail, Hillary Clinton should name reality TV star NeNe Leakes as her running mate. Yeah, and they should hold the debates on Springer, complete with finger-pointing and hair-pulling. In-flight Wi-Fi is often so slow that you're better off sticking to the in-flight magazine. However, new satellite-based Wi-Fi services promise to change that. U.S.-based Viasat is launching two new high-powered satellites that it says will significantly improve broadband speeds next year. Several other companies are also working on their own satellite-based services. Officials say the next 24 months will be crazy, but the result should be faster internet speeds while flying. Finally, what we've all been clamoring for – the ability to check in on Facebook at 30,000 feet. Two men who were angry over their food shot up a taco truck in Stockton, California. Police arrived to find no employees had been shot, but the dissatisfied customers, armed with a shotgun, did shoot up their taco truck. Police gave no details on what specifically the customers did not like about the food. Although my guess would be the food's lack of lead. In Spain, 1,300 sheep wandered into the streets and clogged traffic after their shepherd fell asleep. Well, yeah, I mean, let's see you try to count 1,300 sheep without nodding off. A woman has been caught on camera stealing a ring from a corpse at a Texas funeral home. Apparently, this woman has never, ever seen a single horror movie in her entire life. The California woman has turned her home into a sanctuary for 1,000 cats. Wait, wait, wait a minute, did cats suddenly become an endangered species needing a sanctuary? If so, come to my neighborhood. We've got several here to help restore the population. A woman is in trouble after having her kids blow into a breathalyzer in her car so she could get it started and drive drunk. And it would have worked, too, except her kids were also three sheets to the wind. The website Nameberry has taken a tally of the most popular baby names of this year thus far, and the top five are, for girls, Olivia, Amelia, Charlotte, Ava, and Isla. And for boys, Ezra, Asher, Atticus, Declan, and Oliver. And all four boys' names are sure to get them pummeled on the playground. A driver in Australia is in trouble after police saw him using his seatbelt on two 30-packs of beer instead of the three children in his car. Well, you know, it's always good to have priorities. Find more weird news, download the free mobile app, check out my YouTube channel and more at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. I'm Darren Marlar.